What's going on everybody? This is the Blue Demon Blue Arc 140 MSI MIG and Stick Welder. The 140 MSI is a sub $300 welder that features the ability to MIG weld as well as having stick and flux core welding functionality and is ideal for welding steel, stainless steel, copper, and aluminum all off a standard 120 volt plug. Weighing in at only 22 pounds, this welder is ultra portable, and with its small six inch wide footprint, it can take up very little space in your shop. Included in the box is of course the welder itself, the attached MIG gun, the ground clamp, and the stick welding electrode holder, or stinger. To get started with the different welding processes that this welder can do, we are gonna start off with traditional GMAW, which means we're gonna be MIG welding, and that requires the help of a shielding gas. In this case, 75% argon and 25% CO2. With the bottle and the regulator hooked up to the welder's gas inlet on the rear of the welder, I'm gonna hook up the MIG gun to the positive side of the welder and the ground clamp to the negative side. All of the controls besides the on-off switch are located on the front of the welder. Starting on the left, there is a row of indicator lights. The top light tells you if the welder's over temperature safety system was activated and will stay on until the welder cools down. Directly under that are two more indicator lights dedicated to MIG welding. You switch between them with the selection button located at the bottom. The top light labeled manual is for manual voltage control and the one labeled SYN is for automatic voltage control which synergizes the correct voltage with the amperage and the wire speed. Both of these modes are adjusted with the left control dial. If you are in manual mode, you have voltage control from 15 volts to 23 volts and in synergize or automatic mode, you have fine tune adjustment of plus or minus two volts from where the welder is automatically setting itself. While still set up for MIG welding, the rightmost dial adjusts your wire speed and amperage from 50 amps up to 140 amps, allowing for a wide range of metal thicknesses. Now say you are not able to carry a big gas bottle to a job or it's outdoors on a windy day. Then you might want to set up the welder for FCAW, which stands for flux cord arc welding. For this process, we are going to need to swap out the standard bare MIG welding wire and replace it with a self-shielded flux core wire. The welder can accommodate both two pound and 11 pound spools of wire. Once the wire is fed through the machine, the only other thing that needs to be changed is moving the MIG gun from the positive side to the negative side and the ground clamp to the positive side. All the adjustments work the same as before and you're off welding. Jumping back over to the mode indicators, if we want to switch to stick welding or SMAW, you can easily switch to MMA for manual metal arc welding which can help you with some hard to start electrodes, or to VRD, which means you are using the welder's built-in voltage reduction device. That is a safety feature that reduces the open circuit voltage to a safe value when you are not welding, and then ramps it right back up as soon as you strike an arc. When switching over to SMAW, the stinger is going to be hooked up to the positive side and the ground clamp to the negative. And all of the adjustments is gonna be done with the rightmost knob that adjusts your amperage. In SMAW or stick welding mode, it has a range up to 120 amps. And that's it for this overview of the Blue Arc 140 MSI from Blue Demon. Hopefully this video helps you to decide if this welder is right for your next project. I'm Justin Voss for Blue Demon, and we'll see you next time.